Hi guys, welcome back to Enigma 77 Reviews. So today I'm going to be doing a Kill Star. Now, I do have another Kill Star, or well, I should be having another Kill Star at some point. Um, if you remember, I did the um, tartan skirt and the black open shoulder top. As you probably are aware, I did return them because there was just no way in the world I was going to be fitting into them anytime this year. And I just think buying clothes that are not going to be worn this year is probably, mind you, looking at the way things are this year, guys, I doubt I'll be wearing any more of my clothes. And I probably might, I might as well just go and buy some more jammers. So I think we're going to be in lockdown properly, like for a while. So. I ended up going on to Killstar and exchanging them items, guys. Now, I have not heard anything about the exchange. A few people have told me that they don't let you know, but I just think that's crazy because I'm still paying for... In fact, I've paid for the skirt and the top now, and they've not said we've received it, although I do know they've received it because um, Hermes have contacted me and said that they've received it now. But I've not heard anything to say, yes, we'll be sending your exchange items out. And they haven't arrived. So I don't know what's happening with that. But the day after I did send, um, they re they received their returns. They had another cold percentage off. It was 20% off. And I, I, I don't always jump on the colds, guys. But I just thought, I'm going to have a look at the shoes. Because there's a pair of shoes that I wanted on there. And I wasn't too sure. Anyway, as I was looking, I spotted these. Now... When I first seen these, I would never have been interested in them. Um, and I've got these just in case I can change them. So they arrived today, guys, in this box. At first I was like, what's that? I wasn't too sure what it was because I wasn't expecting a box, even though I did order shoes and I totally forgot that they come in a big box like this. Um, but then I looked at the address and I realised it was Killstar. Ugh. So I thought, oh, it must be, it must be my footwear. Yeah, so it is Killstar, guys. My address is on the opposite side where I did actually open the box. But I thought we'll open it this way so you get to see. Ugh. And all my invoices on the other side. Now, guys, I got 20% off of this. And I also used one of my codes. Guys, I collect my, my vouchers, my money off codes. Um, and I usually save them for something I really, really want. Um, I won't say that this, this would have been my first choice of footwear from Killstar. There's so many other different boots and shoes that I want from there. But to be honest with you, I just... I can't get them out of the box, guys. I just can't justify paying that kind of money for Killstar footwear when I can buy... Jesus. When I can buy such things as New Rocks or Demonias. Right. Well, I've really demolished that box, guys. <laughs> Let me just put the invoice up. Okay, so I got these even cheaper than what they're saying on the invoice here. So, guys, these were on sale. So the money, there was already money off these and there was a 20% off as well. So I thought, do you know what? I'm jumping on that. So this is the box that they've come in. They're super heavy. Box is a little bit damaged at the corners there and here, but obviously these are in sale. So I got a size seven guys and these are she's out there wedges. <laughs> They're definitely out there. Let's put it that way. I was hoping I could change the style on them but if not they are what they are during you know, they're quirky now guys these were 39.98 but i got them for less i think i got them for something like 34.98 or i think i paid something like 30 31 pound i think i paid that was included in the postage so i was quite happy at that because i obviously i had my money off little thing in the little freshener in the lid so yeah, super cheap. Probably the cheapest pair of Killstar shoes I've ever I've ever grabbed. I know I've got my high tops and I've got my bat shoes and I've got my pentagram shoes, but I don't dive into Killstar footwear because I'd rather buy Demonias or New Rocks. So 
So for that reason, this is a rarity that I've gone for these. But I just thought, I've got to wrap them for that price. So guys, these are, she's out the wedges. Let me just oh, put the box down. Oh my God. I didn't realize they were going to be this big. So guys, they're massive. I didn't think they wouldn't be this big. I may end up crockling in these and being in A&E. &E. They're bigger than I expected, guys. But how nice are these for the price? So the reason why I wasn't going to go for these originally is because it's got little spacey men on. But like my mum has been said, that's nothing. You know, this it's just an embellishment design. I mean, I was looking to see if that comes off. No, so they are actually pinned onto the thing. I was hoping that these clipped off and I was going to replace them with like pentagrams or pentacles, but obviously they don't because they're on there. So as you can see, the Velcro, three Velcro across there, and then massive, massive blooming. God, they're bigger than the, the shoes I got from, <laughs> from eBay. These are huge, they're probably, guys, I could do with getting a, a measuring tape and measuring, but going off what I can see here, probably about 15 centimeters in depth on the highest part of the shoe. Here, you're probably going into about an eight, maybe a nine, maybe a 10, and then up to here, it's gotta be at 14, 15 centimeters high, without a doubt. My God, are all kill star? shoes like that I, I I don't know they don't look that big when you look online so obviously you've got a laces here so it ties up and then it says kill start on the tongue of the boot as you can see here um I don't know if they're glued on they look like they're glued on to be honest with you guys they're well packed insert let's take them out Guys, I thought these were so cheap. I don't know if that 20% off is still on, but if these are still there, I mean, I'm a size seven, guys. I don't think they had many sizes left, but they did have my size. In fact, they mainly only had size seven left. They're quite squishy, guys. I like the inserts. They're quite comfortable. Oh my God, I think I'm gonna end up in A&E with these, guys. So these are the She's Out There wedges, and they're a size seven. So the original price is £39.98 and I only paid £31. Now guys, £31, I mean, I paid £22 for my own branded ones from eBay, which I'm going to be putting in a DIY goth gothic kind of video. I probably won't do anything with these. I mean, I was going to take these off possibly. If one of them do fall off or they do come off dead easily, I probably would replace it with such things of like a pentacle or just loads of things you could do with these um i think this is vegan leather i think they're vegan leather i'm not 100 sure it says extra 20 percent off that offer is still on it's score 20 percent off site and 20 percent off clearance she's out there was 49.98 now 39.98 20 percent off um according to this the it's showing that all the sizes are in stock. It says, too alien for earth, too human for space. Four leather, alien hardware, six inch platform sole, lace front and Velcro straps and vegan. So it is vegan guys, show more. It says, get closer to the stars with she's out there platform wedges in a look for, 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 for leather body, lace up front, and triple velcro straps padded and stitched back detail metal alien hardware and six inch thick platform to elevate your game match your heart desire yet get ready for your takeoff with killstar branding 100 percent pu man you man-made materials there you go guys i will try and get these on as quick as I can. Free delivery on all orders over £50. Now, obviously, I only ordered these guys because my exchange items are the only items I wanted on Killstar now. Um, hopefully, I get them and I will do them in a separate video. But, guys, I'll try and get this edit, edited and 
out to you as soon as possible so if you do want to get these for that price you can go ahead and, and get them. Um, quid code doesn't work for Killstar, but it does work for Honey. So if you use your Honey code, you could get more money off as well. That may include your postage free. I think I got my postage free and I used some of my money off codes that I got and I paid £31 for these guys. It's really worth saving up your points and your codes. So I've still got more codes left to use. I've, I've not used any of them and I've bought quite a lot from Killstar. The bottom guys are like this ridged bottom and then it's very, 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 very um, silky smooth here. So they're gripped here, they're not here. I don't know if this in certain weather you would slip because they feel quite slippy. So I don't know, but guys, let's go and do a try on. <laughs> It might not get my head in the shop, guys, but we'll certainly get these in the shop. Um, or I'll just do a video on these in itself and I'll just tell you how comfortable or how uncomfortable they are. Now, on inspection, I don't see any glue or anything like that. They look really nicely made. Really nicely made. Um, let me just check. Yeah, I mean... I wouldn't like to think these falling apart. I mean, I'd be devoured, but if anything, I mean, the the alien embellishment here, they're slightly scratched on the silver, but I just wipe them down. Yeah, they're not too bad. They're quite marked, but that doesn't mean anything to me. I mean, this one's not, but these are quite, if I just give them a, a bit of a dust with my cloth, Oh, it's nothing guys, it is nothing. It comes off completely. So they do polish up really, really nice. I think it was just a little bit of packaging tape or something sticky that was on them. But there you go guys. Killstar, she's out there. Sale platform shoes. Mm. Yes, I know, I'm shoe crazy. I, I'm, I don't, tend to go for a lot of shoes that are quite as big just because I, I need to be careful with my back and everything but um I I'm on the list to buy is obviously my um new rocks which I'm getting for Christmas but um I just thought why not for that price I'm I'm quite scared to try these on guys <laughs> Uh, but the box is great, you know, and quite, it comes in a nice big box, always with nice tissue paper. Um, let's see what they look like on, guys. And um, maybe we'll come back in 12 months' time. If if they last 12 months, we'll soon see. Um, when will I wear these? Oh, God. Do you know what, guys? I don't know. <laughs> because I have a walking aid. I think I'd have to adjust my walking aid to, to like, reach me. Because I reckon these would make me like six foot five or something. Um, my husband will laugh when he sees these. He'll go, Jesus Christ, size of them. <laughs> All right, guys, go try them on. Thank you, Killstar. Um, I'll try and get these on as quick as I can. The reference number for these is 512383. Um, and I got a size seven. Hopefully they have more in different sizes. All right, guys, take care of yourself and I'll see you on the next one. Stay to the end for the trial. Bye for now. I feel like a frigging giant. I don't know if I'm going to get my head in this shot, but um, <laughs> these shoes are um, dangerously high. Like, seriously, they are high. I am not used to wearing like such high platform shoes. I have had pla platform shoes, but not as high as these. Um, I've got to say, I really do like um, Killstar's shoes, but I am scared to death of crockling in these babies because these would hurt my ankle. Like Ben said, it would break my ankle without a doubt. Um, and I'm not the sturdiest on my feet. <laughs> so he, th he thinks this is a dangerous buy for me. Um, but guys, in all honesty, um, I do think they're comfortable. They're really comfortable. Um, I do think that they're quite sturdy as well because if you tighten them around the ankle, it's not too bad. Now, I'm going to do a catwalk in them so you can see what they look like without just the, seeing what I look like in them as a whole. Um, 
they are squishy they're quite comfortable guys in fact they're very comfortable i can't imagine these rubbing my feet so much they're quite roomy um and i've got no socks on with them guys i'm wearing these barefooted um i probably would wear socks with them to be honest with you but i do love everything about these aesthetically pleasing yes they've got aliens on them but i don't really care to be honest with you guys you know at the end of the day they are what they are and for the price i paid for them there's no way in the world i'm going to go and move 31 pound all right let's go and do a catwalk of these guys oh <laughs> dear god help me <laughs> Thank you. 